welcome to Developer TV. We're back with Developer TV. You're here with Dan from the Dev Platform team. Beautiful day in Wellington, as usual, I might add. Now, this is a, I'll admit, it's a bit of a come down from the last episode we did, the Star Wars parody. So instead of trying to top that, we just thought we'd throw in some sweet graphics. So let's see what we've got on the show today. Alright, so we're going to have the who's who and who's new in the ecosystem this month. We'll have Regan talking to one of the developers from the partner of the month, A2X for Amazon. And we're going to have a newcomer, Yasmin, grilling Adam in her version of the release desk. Okay, now there's always a lot going on in the ecosystem. We have over 500 certified apps in the marketplace. Now we've had 11 join us in the last month with superb effort. They're all very high quality integrations. But the one we want to talk about today is A2X for Amazon. Now what they do is they help Amazon sellers use proper accounting software. I know what you're thinking. What use is accounting software in the Amazon rainforest? I know it's a bit... Oh, whoa, 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 hang on a second. Ah, right, sorry. This script's terrible. Actually, it's sellers who use Amazon. Right, I get it now. Okay, so Regan's here to talk to one of their developers, Ashley Schroeder, about the integration. Let's go, Regs. Hey, everyone. Regan here from the Developer Evangelism team in Auckland. Uh, we're here at our Auckland office for Zero, and I've got Ashley Schroeder with me from A2X. How are you, Ashley? Very good, thank you. Very awesome. Good. So can you give the people a little bit of an idea about what A2X is? Sure can. Uh, so A2X is a really easy way to do your... Uh, accounting for Amazon marketplace sales. So we take all of the different sales, revenue items, expenses, fees that Amazon uh, pays you and charges you. Uh, we consolidate them all into um, single invoices and we post those through to zero. And that way the seller, the Amazon seller, can reconcile the deposit from Amazon against the, all the different fees and charges and revenue that they received in that period. Makes it really easy to automate that whole process. And so that's what we did. So. Um, you know, A2X's origins really was as an, uh, initially as an internal tool to do our own automated accounting. And then when we started to see that there was a bit of an opportunity for a tool like this, like no one else was really doing it, we decided to turn it into a, as a service and uh, make it available for other people. Yeah, cool. So what stack did you build the app on? So uh, the app is uh, running in Google Cloud on a platform called Google App Engine. Uh, which is sort of Google's platform as a service offering. Uh, they scale up the web tier and offer a range of services around the outside for things like persistence and caching and task queues. So what made you choose Google App Engine? Um, we'd already built a number of apps on App Engine, so we had a lot of sort of internal experience with it. It was a platform that we sort of trusted, we knew really well, uh, and it was because it's very easy to get up and running, you don't really need to worry about infrastructure, it made it a really a really um, obvious choice just to build an app and get it running quickly uh, and uh, because of the way it scales you don't sort of need to re-architect it every every time you you know move up an order of magnitude of users it just um, just works really nicely and scales very easily without having to worry about servers and infrastructure. So what advice would you have to somebody that was looking to enter the Xero ecosystem? So I would say if, if there's developers looking to build something for Xero I would say if you don't already have the problem find someone that has it and work very closely with them to really understand what the problem is and what the solution is. And I think sometimes you have to be careful not to let them tell you what they think the solution is. You know, as a developer, you have to sort of see through the exact thing that they want and see the more general solution. For doing so well and for coming along, we've given you a beautiful developer t-shirt. Awesome. So Thank thanks you. very much. Thanks Thank for you your time. Thank you very much, Regan. That hey. is very cool. Anytime, man. Awesome. Back to you, Dan. Nice one, Regs. Awesome we get Ashley on the show. I actually met him at Webstock in Wellington this year. Good dude. Okay, so I realized that when we used to do the developer hangouts ages ago, thank God we don't do those anymore, we, uh, we used to introduce new product people to the team. So what I thought we'd do is introduce our new product owner, Yasmin Sifuan. Now she's, uh, she's from Algeria, speaks both French and Arabic, loves mobile, devs like a boss. 
and uh, now she's here to grill Adam in the release disc. See what she's made of. Bonjour tout le monde, comment allez-vous? Je vais parler avec Adam maintenant et vous comprenez probablement pas le français, mais on va tester ça avec Adam. Salut, comment vas-tu? Salut, oui. <laughs> so, thanks Dan, it's definitely super exciting to work with the API team on cool new features. Speaking of new features, you've been dealing with Adam for such a long time now and you've probably got used to him promising new features that he took forever to deliver or that he never delivered. Well, I'm here now and things are going to change and I'm going to show Adam how it's done. Oh, is that so? <laughs> yes. Okay, cool. So, yeah, you mentioned all the features that I haven't been able to deliver. Uh, one of those is webhooks. I'm running out yeah. of excuses for not working on it. Um, have you got any good ones? Uh, I don't have excuses. Why not just work here on webhooks? Wow. So are you saying that there are people writing code for webhooks right now? Yeah. It's a big piece of work, but the work has started. Cool. Well, I'm pleased to announce that the Zero HQ API is now in a closed beta and we're working with some partners to test our use cases and contracts and we'll have more info to share with you very soon. Oh, very cool. So we're going to have a brand new API for our accounting partners. Exactly. Awesome. See how it's done? Watch and learn, Adam. Thank you, Yasmin. I know you're going to be delivering some really cool stuff this year. Now remember, subscribe, share, like, do whatever you need to do, guys. Oh yeah, say hi to your motherboard for me.